Mr Speaker, I call on the leader, Madam Deputy Speaker. The hypocrisy on display here is truly unbelievable. A shadow of the House, Tory MP Chris Philp, while damning Labour over cronyism, acts as if the same thing never happened during the Conservatives' time in office. What a clown. I call on the leader to arrange a debate on ethics and integrity in government. The independent... Well, the independent civil service... The independent civil service commissioner, a former Labour MP, has had to initiate an inquiry into improper appointments by this government. A government of service. It turns out they mean service to their cronies and their donors. It is just wrong to stuff party donors and cronies into what are supposed to be impartial civil service positions. Can you imagine? Can you imagine the howls of protest if the previous government had done that? The Times, the Times, to the civil service. No, the Times report subverting civil service independence by stuffing it with cronies and donors and stripping impoverished pensioners of their benefits. Isn't that popular? After all, I think even the leader will now have to admit the truth. This has been an exceptionally poor start to government. Leader of the Thank you very much, Madam Deputy Speaker. This is a government of service, delivering on our manifesto. As part of that change that people voted for, we've also had to clean up the mess left to us by the party opposite and take the difficult decisions they ducked. A £22 billion black hole that was covered up from the British people and covered up from the spending watchdog. Click here for Philp's nervous swallowing.